I'm not for everybody and that's something I'm cool with what's good y'all it's your girl diva b and i'm back with another video and of course in today's video i will be servicing my client with a box braid bob okay i hadn't done one of these in a little minute um so it felt really refreshing to do and i really enjoyed this style i enjoy doing a box braid uh bobs because it gives a nice like funky look to it like back in the day type look you know and so i always like when my clients you know ask for like those nice funky or you know back in the day type hairstyles kind of nostalgic so i really had fun doing this style and now that you know uh i did service my client with this she made me want to go and add it back to my list of services on my website so that was actually a plus and i hope she enjoyed her hairstyle so in this video i used uh, i actually used the kids expression packs of hair um which is 32 inches i want to say i used five packs of that um in one b and then of course uh for the box braid bobs you know we burn the ends so i just want to take a moment to shout a few people out right now queen sis how you doing boo how's everything with you shout out to waffles mom hey miriam girl how you doing and of course natalie girl what's good I love y'all so much. I appreciate y'all. Y'all don't forget, spam my comments below for a shout out, okay? Comment down below what other hairstyles you all would like for me to service on my clients. This style actually doesn't take long to do. A few hours, maybe. Um, it only took me about roughly five hours yesterday to do because I was filming. And so whenever I'm filming a YouTube video, you know... Uh, I always have to angle my cameras a certain way and set up right for different angles and yada, yada, yada. So it takes me a little more time with um, actually getting my client out of there, you know, in the process of me filming a video for YouTube. But nonetheless, her style was definitely fleeky, honey. Oh, perfect. Right at the good part. Y'all, watch how I do my night. I just want y'all to see how I tie my knot. Now, for you all who have missed out on my lives, I'm now doing lives on YouTube. So I just want y'all to make sure y'all turn on the notifications for whenever I get on this thing. So y'all know to always come through, pull up on me. You know what I'm saying? When I get on live, I need y'all to come on there, show me some love, talk to me while I'm on there. And so I was telling I was telling everybody on there the other day, like I literally just learned how to successfully tie a knot. Look at that. Wow. Mm. And it's tied. You see what I'm saying? So like I make things so difficult. And I don't know why, but I do. It's like I always have to choose the harder way to accomplish something or learn something. You know, not that it's a bad thing, but come on now, tying a knot. On the end of a y'all, let me tell y'all something. I've been doing hair for a very long time. I've literally been trying to tie knots to the ends of my braids for a very long years. I'm talking about years. Like I've watched videos and all. It was like my brain was not registering to tie a knot at all. And it was it's like the simplest thing to do now. It's like I could tie a knot with my eyes closed. The same way I could tie a knot on a damn cherry stem <laughs> with my tongue. <laughs> but that's neither here nor there, you know. But you see, prime example, like, how can I do that? But I can't tie a goddamn knot on the end of a braid. Come on now. <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> Listen, one thing about me, I'm really jokey. Two things about me, I'm definitely going to laugh. And three things about me, I don't give a fuck. Like, <laughs> I really feel like, like, y'all, yeah, enjoy life right now. You know what I'm saying? Like, enjoy life. Live life. Enjoy it. Seriously. For real. Laugh. Laugh. Even when it hurts, laugh. 
Even when you feeling down, laugh. Even when you want to knock somebody out, laugh. I'm like I'm telling you, like laugh for real. I'm over here drinking my nice hot coffee. I love coffee in the morning, especially. I mean, well, honestly, I can really, like, if I was to ever wake up later in the day, say, for instance, if I wake up at, like, 12 p.m., I still have to drink a cup of coffee. Like, I just, it's just something, not that I, not that my, per se, my body may need it, in a sense, but, like, you know, when you get into, like, that set routine, and that's what it is with me, like, that just, that one cup, not even if, I don't even drink the cup of coffee like that. I guess it's just making myself that one cup of coffee. All right, so right here, I'm just burning the tips, uh, well, the ends of the braid with the lighter. I had already cut off the excess hair once I went and tied the knot to each braid at the ends. And then after that, I just hit the the box braid with the lighter, right, to get it hard. Melt it, blend it in, right? Then I go with the scissors, cut it off, the excess hair, and then I go back and I light it like that. If I confuse y'all, I apologize. Go back, watch it again. I mean, one thing about me, I definitely would get off topic, but I snap right back on. Um, so this braid right here, I had kind of messed up. I feel like I had made it too long for that actual bob effect I wanted to see. With this certain client right here, um, the, well, I'll explain that to y'all when we get to that part. No, 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 no. Original. Body nice. I got them the them are moving right. They get them a got me hypnotized Them a make a bad man feel alright Ooh yeah, yeah Man I tell her me she gone low Say you gonna get me when I'm on low Man I tell her me she gone low Bad man I put you in a photo I Count down, she a put me on a rundown Go down, she a give me on a loop now Go down, anywhere you wanna go now Bad man me a put you on a first class no, no, no. So baby, what you gonna do? Calling all your friends when they come through. So you give me your number when I control. So you really, really meant for the girls when they come through. Come through. Bad man, say she want, say she really want, she try to be the one. Ah, uh, calm down, take it slow. Say the key, I let my pop me down, yeah, let my give me low. If you trippin', let me know what you really want. Is it riding with me or you really dirt? Let my girls, let my tell me that you really not. Make up your mind, let me know if you really got. With these box braid bobs, you know, like a whole lot of other braided style, um, box braided styles or whatever. You can pretty much part however you feel necessary. You know what I'm saying? Like, if you want triangle parts, if you want oval parts, natural parts, square parts, shit, heart parts, you know what I'm saying? Octagon, but whatever, whatever parts you want to have that's in your client, you know, y'all talk about it, agree on whatever, that's on y'all, you know? For this particular style, the fastest way I can just execute a bob is to pre-part each row. Wait a minute. Hold on. Shit. Okay. So the easiest way for me to, well, the fastest way for me. Damn, I just lost what I was saying. See, uh, this is why. This is what I, this is what I'm working on as far as explaining stuff. And I'm not even about to take off, take this off, right? I want y'all to hear this. I want y'all to hear my bloopers sometimes you know what i'm saying like i'm not perfect for i mean it is what it is i sometimes i don't know how to explain things 
you know so i'm trying on both ends explaining stuff for my for my listeners and also for my visual people demonstrated y'all work with me i got y'all we gonna elevate on this thing together i don't know i just feel like you know um look at that not again hold on y'all watch this okay so i am measuring the length that i would like each row and y'all like i already said sometimes i take the the harder rows than others so if y'all know a more effective way to um burn the ends as far as with the lighter because y'all stylish y'all know what i'm talking about (laughs) You know exactly what I'm talking about as far as trying to find, like, you know, a a different type of way to actually successfully burn the ends. You know what I'm saying? Because you know our fingers, you know. (laughs) Comment down below, please. Because the ideas I got in my head, I don't know if that will literally make sense. It's it's a style. Y'all know what I'm talking about. I'm not even going to say it in the video. I want y'all to comment down below the answer to what I just asked, okay? Like a hurricane, I'ma 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 do it like nobody can, and I'll give you all the things that nobody can. I'ma make you bounce like a hurricane, I'ma make your bed rock like a hurricane, I'ma 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 do it like nobody can, and I'll give you all the things that nobody can. Stand up, hurricane, ooh, yeah, I want to meet you. Tell them I'm the realest, then they feel me. Kill him on the rhythm, on the rhythm, then they feel me. I'm always all about my business. I got my business and we never ever finish. She know be one to test in my style. Say she wanna throw the dice, body looking nice. From my hips down to her thighs. Then I look her in her eyes. One time, say she know one waste time. Bad man, me na give her one time, night time. Say she want me for lifetime. Bad man, me na give her the pipeline. Enter the place, they be feeling her body. Swinging and moving and killing her body. She ain't got nothing to prove. She ain't got, she ain't got nothing to lose. I'ma make you bounce like a hurricane. I'ma make your bed rock like a hurricane. I'ma, I'ma, I'ma do it like nobody can. And I'll give you all the things that nobody can. I'ma make you bounce like a hurricane. I'ma make your bed rock like a hurricane. I'ma, I'ma, I'ma do it like nobody can. And I'll give you all the things that nobody can. Stop. Hurricane, ooh, yeah. I want to meet you. You are me island too. Beauty now your body gets me eyes can see. Oh gosh, fire can cool. The way you want your body get your fire can cool. Oh yeah. She says she won the rundown. Bad man na me the run town. Then I tell her my lady, my baby, may she calm down. Bad man na me the run town. One time, say she no one this time. Bad man me na give her one time, night time. Say she want me feel lifetime. Bad man, me na give her the pipeline. Give me not the vibe. Say she wanna roll. Moving on her body. Say she don't wanna go. Bad man's on the floor. People them applause. Singing and rapping. I'ma be killing on the floor. I'ma make you bounce like a hurricane. I'ma make your bed rock like a hurricane. I'ma, I'ma, I'ma do it like nobody can. And I'll give you all the things that nobody can. I'ma make you bounce like a hurricane. I'ma make your bed rock like a hurricane. 
I'ma I'm I'm do it like nobody can And I'll give you all the things that nobody can stop For a king, oh, yeah I want to meet Them dope beats. Not much change but the growth with the music. I'm not for everybody, and that's something I'm cool with. Still persistent to get what I want. Stay consistent to keep what I earn. Not much change but the growth with the music. I'm not for everybody, and that's something I'm cool with. Still persistent to get what I want. Stay consistent to keep what I earn. To keep what I earn. Yeah. Different feelings shown when I come around By the same people talking blood when I ain't around Not about to entertain, mess around, lose everything that I done gained Dealing with critics who do not know nothing about my lane Have not even took the time to review and revise No surprise when it come to my art from the start Spoke with rhythm when I talk every sense I began seeing some things so bizarre That's the main reason I be to myself hanging all alone Not too many guys my digits to hit up my phone if you do though then i consider us cool only got a few friends and family i consider true i know i'm the black sheep you don't have to rock with me it's cool with me my music gonna be infinite education majors in english will be defending it scholars pay me dollars to turn my lyrics to modules this is why i'm never bother cuz not much change but the growth with the music i'm not for everybody and that's something i'm cool with still persistent to get what i want stay consistent to keep what i earn not much change but the growth with the music i'm not for everybody and that's something i'm cool with still persistent to get what i want stay consistent to keep what i so keep Niggas actin' yeah. real fishy, tell them hold a tilapia For I aim at your neck, right at your esophagus I came from moving weight like a hippopotamus And made them brainstorm, son Check my philosophy, middle finger to haters Fuck. With no apologies, nah. and you know my mob Deep R.I.P. prodigy I'ma drain the game like I practice phlebotomist And I got my vest on in case they take a shot at me Hoping ricochet and decapitate all my enemies Obviously shit can get nasty Like pornography And everybody ain't your friend Try monogamy Same niggas you cool with A double back attempt the robbery Informants Send the D's to come and search your property Same niggas that be smiling in your face Obviously But in the end I'm thankful for seeing another day Till I'm gone Crunch time like Jordan to fade away Ugh. Not much change, but the growth with the music. I'm not for everybody, and that's something I'm cool with. Still persistent to get what I want. Stay consistent to keep what I earn. Not much change, but the growth with the music. I'm not for everybody, and that's something I'm cool with. Still persistent to get what I want. Stay consistent to keep what I earn. Got them dope beats.
song yeah. Chat in the public by your side ass looking good yeah. In the boys on the block had toys that was looking But nobody was quite like you Cooking meals in the kitchen had you fed good I was taking care of you like a woman should And you was loving every minute Always back into your niggas How nobody treat you like I do I wanted you, you wanted to use me Thought you had a good thing going Baby boy, I'm not a fool
bad man turn up the vibe. Bad man turn up the vibe. Bad man turn up the vibe. Original bad man turn up the vibe. Bad man, bad man turn up the vibe. Bad man turn up the vibe. Bad man, bad man turn up the vibe. Bad man turn up the vibe. Bad man, bad man turn up the vibe. Okay, so remember early in the video I told y'all I had something to tell y'all later on in the video? So now get into the front of my client's um, She had about a good seven, eight braids. Let's just say the first row of her hair itself. Let's say the first row on the front of her hair, so her perimeter. Um, was slightly thinner than the rest of her hair. Okay, so what I did was... I made that specific row. It may not look to you all like that first row is lighter or the braids are smaller, but that's exactly what I did. I made the braids lighter slash smaller so that it wouldn't weigh down heavy on her thin area in the front. That's exactly what I did. And of course, like I always tell my clients, if y'all have any problems, because guess what? I am human, okay? 
I'm not a robot. I'm not perfect. I make mistakes like everybody else. The difference with me is, and I know I'm not the only stylist that's like this. I'm just specifically talking about myself. With me, I give my clients open door, literally. Like, if you have any, any problem, any issue, any concern, hella comment, a suggestion, if you have anything you need to say to tell me, please tell it to me. Inbox me, text me, hell, email me. Send me a smoke signal in the sky. I mean, you know, just tell me that. You know what I'm saying? We don't have to go on social media and talk about it. You know, but we don't have to do none of that. That I tell my clients that we don't have to do none of that because trust me, I got you. No, I do not do refunds on anything. No, but I definitely will make sure you are accommodated. And that's always. Can I please everyone in the world? No. Do I expect to please everyone in the world? No. Have there been clients that may not have ever came back to me because they didn't like my services? Maybe. But at the same time, you know, that we grow and, and, and we can't, you know, you just got to understand you cannot please the world, but leave that door open for your client. Never have your client feel like, I, I really had, I had a client tell me, you know, they had an issue with their hair and I'm going to just be straight up. They had an issue with their hair. They never contacted me and told me at that time, you know, that it was something going on with their hair. And when they did, you know, um, of course we, you know, started working on a problem, but one thing that stood out to me that she told me was she was like, you know, stylists don't know how to pretty much stylists don't know how to, how to handle that. They don't know how to handle that. Hey, I think you messed up my hair or Hey, something is wrong with my hair or Hey, can I tell you something that may better suit my hair or other clients in the future to help you out you know and i told i told them straight up listen nah i no that that's the wrong thing to do and for me for my business is what i'm saying okay for me you tell me you tell me you don't come and you pay me your money i don't care if it was a dollar you know, that's the money that you work for. You don't, you know, you you tell me. You be honest with me. I'm going to be honest with you and you tell me. If you don't like a service I did, tell me. If, if there was an issue, tell me. And I promise you, we will get it situated. You know what I'm saying? But it's just honesty on, on that's, and that's on both ends. I'm not talking about people. Look, y'all see right there? I did now that was a braid that I did extremely smaller. So basically you just, you know, it just um you just go with however you see fit for your client and for their hair. Every client is different, you know, so you accommodate every client differently. That's all it is, you know. But um yeah, like I just I'm really big, like yeah, I'm really, really big on reputation. Like, you know, having a lot of uh, money, you know, it, it pays the bills. It, it, it takes away a lot of, you know, financial stress and da, 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 da. But at the same time, like, you know, what's all the money in the world with a bad reputation, in my opinion, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. I could have all the money in the world, but my reputation is like, oh yeah, she did. She, it's not good. You know, and my reputation is everything. That's why I take my <clears throat> I take my gift so seriously. That's why I take my business so seriously. It's not me, it's not for me to be like, you know, oh, I'm better than somebody or, you know, I know my word good as fuck, so I'm going to charge out the ass or I'm going to have a whole uh a whole list of guidelines and it's it's to secure my reputation. It's to keep my reputation, my find my foundation stable and successful. You know what I'm saying? What's a business without stability? Without building that that stable foundation? What is what is a what is a business like that? That's just like you know what I'm saying? You you y'all know what I'm saying? Shit. <laughs> 
But yeah, like, and that's why I try to tell people all the time, like, you know, it's certain things that you just, <sighs> yeah, listen, this, I just, I really, I love, I love, you know, my clients. I love my potential clients. You know, I love people that support me, period. I don't care if you share a post. I don't care if you watch a video and you comment down below. I don't care if you react to my post, you know, with a, a like, a love, you know, share. that. All that is support to me. You know, I don't focus on people not supporting me. I just don't do that. I don't, I don't, I don't do that. Honestly, like, I really don't do that. You know what I'm saying? It, it, what's the point? You know, you have all these other people, even if it was just one other person supporting you, you know, you put that energy onto people that that's supporting you. You got to appreciate the clientele that you already have. Even if it isn't a client sitting in your chair, support is support. And if you don't appreciate what you already have, how are you going to get mad when your business is not prospering? Y'all, I'm, yo, I'm telling y'all. I could talk all day about business. So seriously, I want y'all to comment down below if y'all want me to start doing videos on, you know, um, business shit. Like, for real, for real. I mean, I have, you know, I, I own a salon now. I opened my barbershop um, February of last year. You know, I really didn't, we didn't have a grand opener or anything for the, the my second building um, because of the coronavirus or whatever. But God is just like, you know, he, yeah, I could talk all day about business for real, for real, all day tips, any, yo, I love y'all so much. This video is about to end. So I love y'all so much. All right. Please subscribe to my channel. Comment down below what other styles you would like for me to do. Follow me on Instagram. O-N-L-Y-O-N-E underscore D-I-V-A-A. All right. I love y'all so much. Share this video. Tell a friend to tell a friend. This style really came out nice. I, I really enjoyed it. Now I want to do some colored vibes. I'm talking about like all orange, all yellow, all red. Shit, rainbow. Shoo. I'm ready. Like this year is just elevation. It's up from here. That's it. That's it. No more talking. No more, you know. Nah, like that's it. So clearly someone needed to hear this message. <laughs> Because I've been ranting this whole video and normally I don't really do too much talking on my videos. But I love y'all again. Thank y'all so, so much. Y'all really don't know how much I love y'all.